Watch this exclusive behind the scenes clips of Gran Turismo in three, two, one. All right, here we go, guys. Everybody, clear pictures. <laughs> The real Jan Mardenborough has actually joined the company as a stunt driver and has been driving both the GT3 race car, the Nissan race car, as well as the Nissan LMP car. He's an outstanding race car driver, but he also turns out to be an outstanding stunt driver. Archie portrays him, and he's the stunt driver that drives Archie's car as Jan. It's like some very interesting meta thing happening there. It is very weird to say that I'm playing myself as a stunt driver. There's been days where it's been a lot to take in, just seeing the scale of everything, the attention to detail. Stand by to rehearse, please. His first day of work, we had literally a 1,000 extras and all these race cars all lined up with the pit crews, the race car drivers. He was amazed and flattered and kind of blown away by the resources being brought to bear to tell his story. The shooting process of just the race, I think, was three weeks. So you're doing that multiple times, multiple days. It must be pretty crazy to be on set on a film where everything is there based on your life, which is very cool to have been able to bring that into reality. There's so much going on, and no lap is the same as the previous lap. I'll need to be watching all the cars overtaking us. We'll have essentially 15 cars blasting by us, and then we'll have to catch them up. Watch your speed. You've got to be in the right place at the right time. If you're off by a split second, everything is off. Send another lap. Send them again. It's just knowing what's coming up and just being not reactive. You have to be proactive. And then you add in cars around you. Overtakes, laser focus, finish line. It's sensory overload. 